At the uh, state capitol, parole justice advocates and lawmakers gathered on what they call the million dollar staircase to honor formerly incarcerated individuals who really turned their lives around. As News and ABC's Michaela Singleton explains now, they're using their stories now to call for parole reform. More than 100 people packed the million dollar staircase, hoping their voices will echo up to lawmakers. We was written off, right? But we demonstrated that we have the ability to transform and evolve mm -hmm. in astounding ways. Wednesday, parole justice advocates and assembly members recognizing community contributions from people who were formerly incarcerated, from volunteer work to educating others to building affordable housing for those freshly released from the system. These honorees say they're committed to giving others the same chance at freedom. One thing I said, when I get home, I'm not going to forget the ones behind. We should not have had to do this again, but here we are. Assembly members also calling on their colleagues to pass two bills. The first being elder parole designed to give people 55 or older who've served at least 15 years of their sentence increased chances at release. Meanwhile, the fair and timely parole bill aims to amend board of parole requirements when making their reviews. Those gathered here say they hope the people of New York will see what good those behind bars can still do. Not only to celebrate the agents of change that we know are all around us when people get free from incarceration, but to call on our colleagues to also recognize that we have to recenter rehabilitation. I am doing the work, I am part of the movement, and I am remembering that when I was incarcerated, someone did this for me, Amen. and so now I stand in the gap supporting those that I have left behind. Reporting in Albany, Michaela Singleton, News 10 ABC.